Hey, I have a question for you. Would you like a neighborhood where people are actually known to sit on their front porches and talk to each other? Would you be drawn to a neighborhood that encourages people to come outside, walk the dog, push a child in the stroller, or just go for an evening stroll? Would you like a neighborhood where it is set up to make it ideal for people to walk to local businesses rather than drive? If this sounds like your kind of place, you need to learn more about Iowa City's Peninsula neighborhood. Come with me today on our neighborhood tour of the Peninsula. Hi there, my name is Emily Farber. I'm a realtor with Leopard Crager Realtors in Iowa City, Iowa, and I create video content on the weekly all about real estate and the greater Iowa City area. If you're thinking about making a move to the Iowa City area, you should totally download my free relocation guide. I have a link for it down below in the description box. If you're watching this on a mobile device and you don't see a description box, don't worry about it. All you need to do is tap the title of this video and the description box will open right up. You're also going to find my contact information down there in case you want to reach out to me about buying or selling real estate in the greater Iowa City area. I do have people reach out to me off of YouTube all the time and I absolutely love it because there's nothing better than helping somebody achieve their real estate goals. The Peninsula neighborhood began as a concept between the City of Iowa City and development partners in the mid-1990s. Construction began in the early 2000s on the planned development with new urbanism principles. New urbanism is a planning approach based on how cities and towns used to be before the heyday of suburbia. Featuring walkable blocks and streets, a mix of housing and shopping in the same area, and accessible public spaces. According to the Congress for New Urbanism, New Urbanism is about creating sustainable, human-scaled places where people can live happy and healthy lives. The peninsula is known for homes built on narrow lots close to the street and adorned with front porches, stoops, and balconies to encourage people to come out of their houses and engage with their neighborhood. There are no front-facing garages in the peninsula. Most garages are off of alleyways to the rears of homes. There is a variety of housing, small businesses, and public space in the neighborhood by design. The aesthetic of the peninsula is a throwback to timeless classic styles, including strong influences of modern craftsmen, modern colonial, and brownstones. In addition to the appealing aesthetics of the neighborhood, its location gives residents quick access to downtown Iowa City, the University of Iowa campus, and Interstate 80, which makes getting to Coralville and North Liberty easy for Peninsula residents. The peninsula is located on high ground carved out of a bend in the Iowa River. In the heart of the peninsula, you'll find Emma Harvett Square, a public gathering space and playground for the neighborhood. As far as schools go, children in the Peninsula neighborhood attend Lincoln Elementary, Southeast Junior High, and City High School. The peninsula seems to be a very dog-friendly community. I see people out walking their dogs every time I'm in this neighborhood. Because many of the homes in the peninsula have quite small yard spaces, residents make good use of Iowa City's Thornberry Off-Leash Dog Park, which is located in the peninsula. If you'd like to know more about Iowa City's dog parks, I'll leave a card linking you to a video I did about them. Home prices in the peninsula are higher than average when compared to the greater Iowa City area as a whole. Here in 2020, the median sold home price for a single family home during the last year in the peninsula neighborhood was $415,000. The median sold price for a condo in the peninsula was $246,000. When I sift around in the MLS numbers, 
I see that the lowest price property to sell in the past year in the peninsula was a one bedroom, one bath condo for $168,000. The highest price property to sell in the past year in the peninsula neighborhood was a 3,600 square foot, four bedroom, two and a half bath, single family home for $659,000. If you're interested in more Iowa City neighborhoods, you should check out my playlist. I'll leave a link for it up above. I add videos to that playlist pretty regularly, but if you don't see what you're looking for, tell me about it. Leave me a comment in the comment section down below. I love to get comments like that because then it gives me ideas for future upcoming videos. While you're there, be sure to click subscribe so you don't miss out. If you're feeling especially generous, you could always give me a thumbs up on this video if you found my content to be helpful in your research of the Iowa City area. Hey, it's been fun and I'll catch you later.